Okay, we had a new Trader Joe's, and I just wanted to go check it out. They had a lot of interesting face products, such as that uh, moisturizing face cream, and they had a lot of gels. Now, I thought this one was interesting. If you like pumpkins, they had this overnight pumpkin face mask that looked very interesting. Um, they also had this rose water uh, facial toner. They had a lot of things for your face, not so much for the body. Uh, like I said, they had a lot of items of face washes, a lot of face creams, facial creams. Um, now this I did purchase and that was the cleansing oil. I have never tried this. Um, it's a shower and bath cleansing oil. I definitely wanted to give that a try. I was looking for more body butters. Um, they did have some oils. This was a jojoba oil um, that was very interesting. Um, hydrating hyaluronic body gel cream. They had a lot of hyaluronic acid products. And of course, they had the tea tree um, body wash. And then they had the shampoo as well. Next up was Bath and Body Works, and when you enter into the store, they had all of these fall candles just sitting there, just smelling luscious and looking good. They had so many different fall scents. Here is one that has sweet corn. I had to try that. And you guys, this fairy tale, it smells so good. If you get a chance, uh, you might want to check this one out because I started to purchase this one. I didn't, but yeah. Yes, I did love the way that smelled. They also had the perfume. Yes, these were very, very, it smells very good to me. I like the way that one smelled. And if you like the aromatherapy, I definitely uh, tried this one out. And this one is the Awakening Sun. Oh my goodness, it smells so good. If you like bergamot, this is one for you. And here was some more fall scents if you like to try this. If you like pumpkin and chai, they have it there. They have that. They have amber. And then they have like this uh, ruby apple. These all were different scents that you might like. All right, guys. Here's the haul. Let's go ahead and see what I got. As I mentioned to you guys earlier in other videos, I'm looking for healthier base products. I'm looking for a cleaner base product because I'm trying to do better. <sighs> I love the way things smell. Some things I really just don't care because it smells good, but I'm attempting <laughs> to look for better products. So here's this uh, tea tree tingle body wash and it says it has peppermint, tea tree, eucalyptus, and botanicals. That screams health. It screams healthy to me. So when I smell it, mm, it smells good. Have you guys tried? Leave me a comment down below. Let me know if you tried the Tea Tree Tingle Body Wash. It was pretty inexpensive. It's a nice size. It's 16 fluid ounces. I think it was $3.99. They had the shampoo and conditioner too. I know that um, Whitney from Natural 85, she loves their shampoo and conditioner. She used to use it all the time. So I'm definitely going to give them a try. Uh, yeah, and I think this is this is healthy, right? I think this is really healthy. So, yeah, I grabbed that up. Now, so, mm, sounds bougie a little bit. It's called Nourish Shower and Bath Cleansing Oil with Almond Oil. Now, on the back, it says, on contact with water, that this cleansing oil will turn into a sheer, milky, hydrating wash that cleanses the skin while helping maintain moisture. Let's just smell this. Let's see what it's like. Now, that smells good. I love the almond oil scent, um, scent anyway, you guys. It smells really good. I mean, I cannot wait to try this. I wish I had got a couple of more because this bottle seems small. But, um, yeah, I can't wait to try it. And, you guys, Trader Joe's is new to my area. So, when I went to the store, everybody, their mama, daddy, sister, cousin, uncle, was there. So, we really couldn't just shop and just really, you know, do like I wanted to, move around like I wanted to. So, we just kind of dipped in and dipped out. The body butters that smells, you know, like the bum bum cream, they didn't have that. They just had a coconut body butter. I didn't want that. I didn't see the one that I wanted. I heard it's hard to get that at Trader Joe's, but that's what I was looking for. Uh, Trader Joe's Lemongrass Coconut Body Oil, and it has almond and whole oils in this also. Now, I'm not going to lie. I didn't smell this in the store, but when I got it home, I'm like, mm-mm. I don't know. 
it didn't smell like lemongrass to me. It, you know, it smells like a essential oil. It smells like essential oil. And I'm not saying I'm not fond of those things, but some I'm fond of more than others. And this one I'm not necessarily fond of. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep this, but um, it says it's gentle, light, and aromatic. Moisturize the skin without being greasy. Leave me a comment down below and let me know if you've tried this. Do you have this? And how do you like it? Before I take it back, I may want to give it a try. Who knows? But, um, you guys, have you ever made a purchase and then you got home and you're like, I messed up. I think I got the wrong thing. That's what happened to me at Bath and Body Works. I actually had fairy tale in my hands because I love fairy tale. But there was a lady, there were a couple of ladies asking, where was the sweater weather? They were like, where's the sweater weather? I've been looking for that. That's my favorite. That's my favorite. So I'm like, mm, I forgot I got the candle. I love the sweater weather candle. So I'm like, I'm going to grab that too. That's what I got. <laughs> I got the sweater weather. But when I put it on, it smells like outside. On, on me, I, it just smells like I was outside. You know how you go outside and it smells like it has that fresh smell? It's like... I like fairy tale better. I like fairy tale better. So oh, I think I'm gonna have to go back and get fairy tale. I'm gonna have to exchange this because I'm not feeling the sweater weather in the spray. I didn't try the spray, but in the lotion in the spray. I know if you love it, I'm so sorry. But um, because I do love the candle, but I just I messed up. I messed up. I'm gonna have to take this back. But um, yeah, it's, it doesn't smell bad. It doesn't smell bad, but for $40, I'm like, I need to get what I like. So, this is going back. Okay, so another thing that I got, you guys, um, this was when Bath & Body Works was having a sale online. And let's see here. I got this car air freshener holder. Oh, this is called the Mermaid Waves Um visor clip you clip it on your visor the scents that go into into that i got two raspberry tangerine and waikiki coconut beach i got two of each of these and i think they were two dollars so a dollar each so yep these were a dollar each all of this for 5.99 so yeah, I thought that was a pretty good deal. I thought that was a pretty good deal. And I've heard some people say, don't get these because they don't last that long. But for this price, I think it's, I think it's fine. Um, if you can catch them on sale, I think it's a good idea. So, yeah, I have to let you guys know how I like those. Um, because I do like air fresheners. I know some people have allergies and may not be able to use those. But I'm going to give it a try. Okay, and the last thing that I got, now this was from um, Dollar General, you guys. I just have a little bit of everything in here. And this is the Vanilla um, Body Fantasies. You guys, don't sleep on Body Fantasies. Their stuff smells good. This is a vanilla one, and I love it. It smells so good. I've been watching this one, but I never picked it up. I usually get the coconut one or the sweet pea one. But um, they also had a clear one I thought about getting too. But I just have so much stuff. I think it was white musk. And I already have the, my Jovan white musk. It smells similar to it. It really does. I really should have got it for a layer to layer the spray and then the cologne. But anyway, I wanted the vanilla. It seems more wintry, you know, warmer and everything. So, yeah, that's what I grabbed from Dollar General. So, yeah, that's it for my haul, you guys. Like I said, I'm headed back over. I'm headed back over there tomorrow to Bath & Body Works. I'm going to have to just, I'm going to just get, I think I'm going to switch this out and get the um, fairy tale. I love the way the fairy tale smell. Yeah, and I tested that on me and I love it. So, I'm going to have to switch this out. I'm not afraid to take something back if it does not what I want, you know, because that's my money. I work hard hard for my dollars you hear me <laughs> just like everybody work hard for their money so and i really do want and need to do another giveaway i have so many products you guys i have so much stuff i really want to do a giveaway 
but like I said, um, with everything going on, I cannot do it in other countries. It has to be within the United States. That's the only reason I haven't done it. And I do not like for anyone to feel discriminated against or feel like they're not a part of things or they're not appreciated because everyone is appreciated. But because my last my last giveaway caused so many problems to my channels, you guys. It caused so many problems that most people would not understand. That's why I can't explain it. That's why I just said I wasn't going to do it anymore. I know that's what I said. But here we go. I'm going to have another small giveaway, you guys. This was not going to be anything big or grand that makes folks want to get depressed if they don't win. But it's a little something. It's a little something. Okay, the first thing that's in here is this Lux and Willow um, anti-aging satin eye mask. So it's fur on one side and it's satin on the other. I thought that was too cute. That's going to be in there. And then we have these moisturizing foot masks. And these are so good. I have some myself. I've tried them. They really, really work really well. They have coconut and rose petal. And they're like a little bag. You just stick your feet in and just kind of walk around the house. I put socks on over them and just walk around the house. And they really work good. They really moisturize your feet and soften them up so good. So it's three pair in here. That will be there. And then I have these exfoliating washcloths. There's two of them in here. It's a two-pack. They massage, exfoliates, renews dry, dull skin, and it's for all skin types. That will be in there. And then I have this from Dirty Works. This is a creamy cleanser with cucumber, spearmint, and green tea extract. Very good. That's going to be in there. Now, um, we have this cute little headband for what, when you're doing your facials or you're doing your skin treatment or anything to get your hair out of the way. This is cute little headband that will be in there. And then I also have this brown sugar and fig. I have the lotion and the body wash. It's a nice little giveaway. And this is in no way affiliated with YouTube. This is things I purchased with my money that I'm giving away to a subscriber to show my appreciation. The stipulations are that, sadly, you have to live in the United States. You have to be over the age of 18 to enter. And what you guys don't know is I really don't spend a lot of money on this. Yes, I purchased them with my money, but while I'm shopping, I look for deals to do giveaways. This is what I used to do. Actually, I haven't been doing it anymore because I was so discouraged from my last giveaway, you guys, and the way people behaved. I was so discouraged. So I just said I wasn't going to do it anymore. But I have these items that I already had. And as you can see, I'm going to leave the price tags on them. They were clearance. This was only $3. This was, I think it was a dollar. I think it was a dollar, you guys. I didn't spend money on anything. This was a dollar. But I look, when I, when I looked, um, when I shop, I look for gifts for a giveaway. It doesn't mean I spent a lot of money on it. They were great items, but I caught them on sale. So, I don't know. When people get depressed and have attitudes and unsubscribe, it's like, why do it? You know, why do it? But I don't want to punish everybody else because of, you know, a few people. But uh, my last giveaway was really, really bad. It was really, really bad, you guys. I don't want bot subscribers. I don't want people who aren't genuine subscribing to my channel just to win. You know, I don't want that. I'd rather that if you're not genuine that you don't subscribe. That's just the way I feel about it. But if you are genuine, please do. Please do subscribe. And if you like my content, please subscribe. And um, we love to have you a part of the family. And there will be giveaways, you know. But I'm just going to have to find a happy medium to where I can do this. To where my channel isn't affected. But I still can give back. You know what I'm saying? 
So bear with me while I work through this, you guys. I appreciate your patience. And for this giveaway, um, all you have to do, please watch the video all the way through and like the video and leave me a comment that you want to enter and that you are subscribed. You live in the United States and that you are of the age of 18. That's it. It's no big elaborate thing. Yeah, that's it, you guys. I really hope you enjoyed the video. And like I said, if you're new here, take a look around my channel and see if there are things that you like. If you like my content and you want to enter the giveaway, please enter and please subscribe. So that's going to wrap it up for me. I appreciate your time. I appreciate you stopping and spending this time with me because you couldn't have been doing anything else. But you're here with me and I appreciate you. And hopefully I'll be seeing you in my next video. Take care.